Big money! <laughs> Players, what's up, teammates? This is Star Player back again. We got another cook-up going. This time, we're going to do something a little different. If you got Serato Studio, I'm going to show you how to take any sample out of Serato Studio and put it in your favorite DAW. If Serato Studio is not your favorite DAW, you know you're having trouble with the workflow or whatnot, and you got a DAW you're more comfortable working with, but you like the sounds coming out of Serato, I'm going to show you how to drag that sample into your favorite DAW and get the cooking up something special. So let's do that. I got a sub lab loaded, but first off, what you're going to do, we're going to go to the file folder, wherever your files are, right? You find your uh, home drive, because Serato saves it in a Serato folder. So wherever you put your Serato sounds at, I don't think you have an option to change that. I know in the, some uh, um, VSTs you have an option to put your sounds where you want to. But Serato, it just goes on your on your home drive. So you go to, you go to your users, you go to your music folder, and you go to Serato Studio, you go to content, and here are your packs. You go to audio sample. There you go, you got all audio sample. So yeah, you do it like that and then you can go to any anyone with the packs. Now if they're just instruments or patterns, of course it's not going to show up as an audio file, but you know. All right, let's do it. Let's try this. Let's, uh, let's put some hi-hats in it and see if we can get a rhythm going. All right, we're just building some hi-hats. If you know about Studio One, you know I like to use the, uh, the step sequencer to do my percussion and stuff, so. It's a little take from the FL Studio book. You know what? Let's keep building. Let's put a kick in him. Let's do one of these kicks. Ooh. We're going to add a kick to it. Let's see if we, uh, I don't know if we can speed it up a little bit. Speed it up. And let's filter out that sample. Take some of that low end out of that sample. Because you know what we're going to do. We're going to 808 that hole. All right, let's EQ this sample out. All right, we got a little pattern laid out with an 808. Let's do some more with these drums. Ooh. Let's do that. Repeat function. You know, I heard something. Let's try this. I heard this. While I was playing around, let's see what that sound like. Yeah. 
I like that. We don't have these hi-hats fluctuating like this. Put a uh, open hat in it. Just, just drag that in. We'll just drag the open hat in. And copy it. Just like that, man, we got a little loop cooked up with a little drum behind it, nothing complicated. I didn't build a beat all the way up or whatnot, but I just wanted to show you guys how you can put a sample from Serato Studio in your favorite DAW and get to cooking like that. You know what I'm talking about? And that's how we do it. Let's play it back.